Hi guys, we're Deep Blue Pictures. My name's Danny Mooney. And I'm Eddie Rubin. And we are a local film production company that started here in Michigan and will stay in Michigan because of the generous film incentives that are offered to producers of up to 42% of their budget. What's incredible though is it's not just producers, directors, and cinematographers that benefit from this incentive. That's right, so we're gonna go on a little road trip today to the people and the businesses around the state that are benefiting from the film incentives that you never would have guessed have any part in film. But first we're gonna introduce our crew. This is our other cinematographer, Jeff. This is sound guy Steve, and this is debauchous. And our last crew member is Billy the Thunder Blue Mustang. We borrowed her from a friend. Our friend doesn't know we borrowed her, but they'll figure it out. I thought you asked them. Eddie. How you doing? This is a lot of machinery. So guys, tell us what was going on before the incentive hit and what happened to you guys and your company after the incentive. We had just started, we started two years ago. Our first year as a startup was pretty slow. Honestly, the, the films, the orders we got through Stone and Flipped probably made us profitable for the year. Those were huge orders for us, got us through our first year. And then the second year, uh, we just did a ton of stuff for Scream 4 and Little Murder and a lot of other movies and those are pretty much paid for about a quarter of our equipment. And what, what percentage of your business right now would you say is purely film related? I'd say 35%. Wow. And did you tell us on the phone you guys have a gift for us? Yeah, we actually, we're really excited that you guys are doing this and we wanted to show you that we're absolutely in support of this. What? We you guys I'm a little scared. Do really well. Oh wow, can you read that off to us? High five for film incentives. That's awesome. And the, the lower peninsula, high five. And then yeah, read us the back here. Oh wow. But seriously, if you cut the film incentives, I would lose my livelihood and possibly even the shirt off my back. For real. <laughs> the film incentive works. Wow. And I feel like I can identify with the back. Hey, high five, guys. High five for film incentive, high guys. Five for film you incentives. are amazing. Thank you. Yes, here. Let's, uh, let's get our shirts on. Hey, good luck, guys. All right, guys, so what's happened since the incentives have passed? Since the incentives have passed, RSIG Security has been able to employ over 200 new people for the past two years. In a company that lost over $30 million in the auto industry, we've been able to take the company out of the red and put it back into the black. Wow. The, company, the film incentive has basically kept us in business today. Um, is, is this man your personal security guard? Because he looks like he's eyeballing sound guy Steve with a <laughs> massive boom hanging over your head. He's actually one of our sales guys. You guys needed somebody pretty, so we had to dress him up and pull him out of the office. <laughs> They have saved my business. I mean, I was going out of business, and now I am in business to stay. Well, when the incentives uh, were put into place, it was right around the time that I left Ford Motor Company. As the incentives kicked in, it looked to be a good opportunity to, to, to start an independent business. There was no chance of me finding a job, per se, in any media or entertainment industry in this area. So it was pretty much said that I had to leave, and when it came to be, it opened up a whole new floodgate of opportunities for myself and my peers, so it's been wonderful so far. Well, I will tell you, this year alone we've done over 6,000 room nights in movie crews. You know, our occupancy has, has jumped you know, 10 to 15 percentage points. Well, it's been exceptional. It's not only allowed me to not necessarily lay off people because of the downturn, but enabled me to hire eight additional more people. We've spent a considerable amount of money in the state of Michigan, and it's benefited us greatly. You won't find that anywhere else. <laughs> My business has basically doubled in the last two and a half years since the film incentives came into Michigan. We're continuing to expand and hire more people to help with um, the business that has come in from the film incentive. Well, it's been good work. The guys get some overtime, it's all good. 
These guys in Lansing, they did a good job in getting them here. They need to do whatever it takes to keep them here. Yeah! That's awesome. Childhood dream. When the recession hit, and at the same time, the incentive was just passed. So I saw this wonderful opportunity to kind of go back to what I love and what I was passionate about. Now I'm doing what I love and I'm able to stay in a state and be around my family and friends. Beforehand, I had to leave the state to go do what I loved. We were backyard parties, uh, festivals, and corporate work. Now we're film, corporate. At what percent would you say is film? Uh, 80%. Yes. We've started with just myself, and now I have probably 10 or 12 guys that work with me, um, and we are busy almost every day throughout the year. If Debosh is here, was to jump at you right now, yes. would you use a karate chop or some sort of joint lock? So, so we would block, we come across, and we take Debosh just now and just something like this. And we say, kiss the floor, kiss the floor guy. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Wow, you're welcome. not destroying me. Well, folks, that's all we have time for today. We hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. And in conclusion, we wrote a little letter. Dear sir or madam who has any say over the film incentives, I hope you realize just how much the 42% tax incentives have benefited the entire state of Michigan. 42%. Not only do the companies benefit, but it keeps young, talented people in the state working and not moving to New York or LA. That's right, and it's not just us. There are thousands and thousands of Michiganders that make a living because of the film incentive who may not have received a paycheck otherwise. I've been an extra 56 times. There is no other initiative that puts such a positive image on this state like the Michigan Film Initiative. And let's face it, who doesn't love film? Sincerely, Eddie and Danny. They really were.